I've had an idea for a mini semi that I've been wanting to do for a long time and I've had it in my brain and it's been bugging me to death so I thought well I need to start putting it together a little bit at a time and seeing uh, what I can do with it. So I started laying it out, got some basic dimensions. Uh, everything I do, I do by trial and error. Uh, I just had to guess at what my measurements were going to be. Uh, but this is just a short video of some of the stuff that I've done so far on it. So let's continue with this video showing you about the Mini Semi. This is what I'm using for the frame, and as you can tell, it's going to be pretty long. This is the start of the, the front end. This piece is going to be the, the front axle. Uh, these pieces on the end will hold the steering pieces. I don't have it sitting in there right, but anyway, I think it's the wrong side, but you get to see what that kind of looks like. We have the pivot here in the middle and the pivot right here, and then I'll have another one of these pieces on the other side with a one inch pivot shaft running through there. And I've already gone ahead and sleeved and drilled and tapped a piece for a uh, uh, grease fitting to go in here that will put grease into inside of here so I'm getting ready to do a lot of this finish welding on all this piece and that's getting this project started so let's see what we can do next As you can see, I got some more of it welded up, fabbed up, and uh, kind of see how the front suspension is going to work. Like on a front of a lawnmower, only a little bit larger scale. Got the just a temporary one inch pin through there for it to pivot on. Got my grease fitting right there. just set in place right now for initial mock-up purposes. This is a, basically about where I'll be sitting. Get the steering wheel on here about where it's going to go. I'm just holding it in place right now just for initial placement purposes and getting some measurements. But if you come on back here you can see oh, sorry about that. trip over everything. Okay. There's the about where the motor is going to be sitting and then the wheels about where the axles will be just sitting there for measuring purposes but I think I'm going to go with this write down my measurements for where the placement of everything is and just an initial initial placement mock-up I've got the motor back off of it and the pieces back off of it that were just sitting on there and I'm pretty well set with this is where the motor is going to be. So I've used this heavy gauge 2 inch by 2 inch square tubing um, to give me a good heavy base to mount the motor on. Uh, I'm going to get this all welded up and get it set in place. We'll go on to the next thing.
this is the basic frame of the body I'm essentially going to make a roll cage and fill it in with metal is the idea so this is the start of it and we'll just see how it ends up getting the upright pieces on now really having to get everything square and level uh, trying real hard to make sure I do that this gives you an idea of the scale of what the body is going to be this is this is cab and sleeper is all going to be one, one thing of course they'll have I'll have the uh, hood on the front of here but right now I'm welding up the body mounts I'm making body mounts for all this to set up onto so um, I'm using 2x2 two two square tubing and I'm going to be welding them on here so let me get started Starting to get a basic idea of the outline of this truck. Um, the size of the cab and the hood, the nose and all that. I haven't been showing you every little step of this because, you know, I guess it could probably get pretty boring just watching me cut and piece and weld and every little step. So I'm just kind of showing you as I'm, as I'm going what I'm doing on this one but hope you're enjoying watching it so let's go further this is with the tires setting up against it and at about the, the height that it's going to be sitting uh, with the back tires on here too kind of give you an idea of how it's going to be setting that's the basic outline of it and that's where I left off please look up Kevin's creations on Facebook and give us a like please subscribe to our YouTube channel and like our videos it helps us out keep coming back watch for more videos thanks